It's another great skiing exhibition, folks. The great Swedish skiing superstar is just about to break the world's record. Oh, goody, goody. I love skiing, yeah. Nothing in the world gives me so much joy. <gasps> <gasps> What do you think you are doing? Wondering who would watch an old-fashioned sport like skiing. Hey, was watching it. Oh, so you're old-fashioned. Get your hands off of me. You better watch it, Woodpecker. Skiing is the sport of my fatherland. Ah, uh, more like the sport of your grandfatherland. Snowboarding's where it's at. Yeah, well, skiing's the greatest sport. Snowboarding. Skiing. I still say snowboarding's the best. Can't decide on the best method to get down a frozen mountain? Then you should sign up for the Inertiathon, the all-out freestyle race to the bottom of Mount Incline Plain. It's the downhill experience of a lifetime. What's in it for you? Well, the first to reach the bottom wins 50 bucks, a year's supply of cornmeal, and a firm handshake. This will settle it once and for all, you bet. I challenge you to the race. You're on. Well, here we are with two lively contestants who hope to settle the debate of which is better. Ski! Snowboarding! <laughs> Although there's some folk who stick to the old standby, tobogganing. Hiya, buddy. Tobogganing! <laughs> 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 Well, I guess this little difference of opinion will be settled on the slopes. Racers to your marks. Hey, Wally, your boot's untied. Hold my poles, Bootpacker. Get set. Bootpacker, my poles. Here you go. Some ski vax. If he wants to stick to skiing, I'll make him stick but good. This glue will do the trick. <laughs> skiing, I will go. Skiing, I will go. I will beat the woodpecker and make him eat my snow. Try snowboarding, Wally. I'm a ski. I show them a thing or two. Oof! Ah! Well, at least I landed safely. Sure showed that too, Planker. Hmm. <laughs> Wally get through that. Oh, ogly mogly. Moguls are my specialty. Woodpecker! See you later, Wally. <laughs> yeah, hello? This is Wally. Remember that favor you said you owed me? Well, 
I want the woodpecker taken care of. You know what I mean. Consider it done. Mm -hmm. Swedish meatballs. Time to meet your maker, Woodpecker. Get it? Meet your maker. <laughs> I crack myself up sometimes. Oh my gosh! Swedish Hitman! Oh yeah! There's the finish line. Another great toboggan victory! How does tobogganing compare with skiing and snowboarding? I told you! World's greatest sport is tobogganing! Nothing higher! Nothing closer to perfection! How many times do I have to tell you? Can you people get a three reds? Tobogganing rules! Oh, it's my purpose in life. Boy, oh boy, do I love Christmas! I told Pop I wanted a new set of golf clubs. I told Winnie I wanted a big screen TV. I told Not Hidden Splinter I wanted... <gasps> Not Hidden Splinter! I forgot to get them anything! Coming through! <laughs> Made it with time to spare. Say, free gift wrapping? Well, jingle my bells. <laughs> oh, switching people's Christmas presents for rocks is the best scam I ever come up with, Tweaky. But it's Christmas, boss. I'm sick of working so hard. The rocks are heavy. I got paper cuts. We got us another customer. And it looks like a two-rock job. Free gift wrapping, huh? Yeah. Like the saying goes, when you give it, we take it. Yeah. That's it. Oh, please, Sandy. I want some ointment for all my cuts. I want my own assistant so I can bully someone around a lot. Say, what's with the rocks, paper, scissors, switcheroo? It's like this. Rock beats what? And step on it. <laughs> Tweaky, I'm going out for a ceremonial Christmas pizza. You count up all our loot. Oh, but you can't go out, boss. We gotta get to bed so Santa Claus can come. How many times I gotta tell you? We just stole people's Christmas gifts. So Santa ain't gonna visit us this Christmas or any other. If Tweaky wants Santa, then Santa he shall get. I hope Sandy doesn't mind this stocking smelling a lot. Oh, Siri! Siri! 
Jerry, it's really you. Oh, what a cherry nose and a white beard and a bowl full of jelly. Just what the heck do you think you're... I mean, ho, ho, ho. What the heck are you still doing up, little Tweaky? I was just going to bed, Sammy. But first... No buts. Santa's got a lot of work to do. For Christmas, I want a U.S. mint soap for laundering money, a scholarship to the School of Hard Knocks, a gift certificate to... Not if I'm not hidden Splinter's presents. I want a file for breaking out the next time I'm in the pokey. I want an all-access skeleton key. I want a good solvent so none of my charges get. I want a prison suit with vertical stripes, because that's the limit. I want a buzz buster. I want a laser-guided satellite. I want to have the power of flight. And I want to get out of jail free time. And I want a bumper sticker that says I break an enter. And I want a remote control getaway car. Oh, 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 and gobs of lard. <sighs> now I know why Santa only comes once a year. I want a really fast getaway car and... <gasps> Sandy, where's your sleigh with the eight tiny reindeer? Well, uh, I... Oh, my goodness, you're right. I must have been... Slager! No, oh, I told the boss his neighborhood wasn't so good. Oh, Tweaky, whatever will Santa do? <gasps> I could steal a new sleigh. I'd even pull it for you. But you're so small. Why, I bet you couldn't even move, say, this tiny sleigh. Sure I could. <laughs> Tweaky. What are you doing? I'm helping Santa Claus. <clears throat> that ain't Santa Claus! Yeah, says who? This guy's trying to take our loot. No, boss. He's really Santa Claus. And oh. you said he wasn't gonna come! Tweaky goodness. If you stole all this stuff, we have to return it if Santa's going to give you anything at all for Christmas. Don't listen to him, Tweaky. I'll give you anything you want for Christmas. I want gifts from Santa Claus. Yikes, Tweaky, stop! No, no, no! On buzzard, on convert, on flea bag. Tweaky, get back here! That's not Santa. When I get my hands on you, I'll make eggnog out of you! Stolen gifts back to all their rightful owners. Merry Christmas, not hidden splitter. <laughs> What a cold Christmas this turned out to be, especially in the Arctic regions. One thing's for sure, Santa's got it made in the shade this year. The jolly old elf's toy delivery route will take him around the world, including stops in warm spots like the Bahamas, San Tropez, and Bora Bora. Guess we'd all like to ride along with him this Christmas. Santa makes the list, but as head elf of this here workshop, it is my Christmas duty to check it twice. Naughty, naughty, nice. Why, looky here. Little Robbie gets a paddle ball. Hmm, eye hand coordination never was my strong suit. The great thing about this toy is that it feels so good when you stop. I better get back to work if and I want to be Santa's exclusive ride-along helper this year. Hmm? 
Now, now there, little fella. Santa's got a rule against peeking at presents before Christmas. Yup. I'm sorry, but you gotta make like you're under the mistletoe and kiss off. Huh? <laughs> Ouch! I'm telling you for the last time, this here sack is not for peekers. I'm gonna send this penguin all the way to springtime. The holiday season is not the best time to take up running. Oh, Smedley! Smedley! Smedley, where are you? Uh. Now, Smedley, there's no time to lay about on the job. There's work to be done. <laughs> you need to finish up the gift list while I get ready for my midnight ride. Aye, ah, ah, Mr. C. Right away, sir. I gotta work extra diligent like now so as I can get to ride along with Santa Claus. Doggy, check. Ah, uh, ain't he cuter than a bug's ear? Ducky, check. <laughs> Kinda reminds me of Aunt Mabel's Thanksgiving dinner. Not nearly enough stuffing. Pangu penguin? <laughs> Looks like I got me a misfit toy. This is what we elves call an occupational hazard. You are hankering to be numero uno on Santa's naughty list, aren't you? Here's one finely crafted airplane. <sighs> yes, sir. With my attention to detail, Sam is sure to pick me as this year's ride along elf helper. Mm -hmm. Usually it's the tree that gets trimmed, not the elf. <laughs> ding, ding, ding. I'll ground that penguin for sure. Huh? Whoa! I say, whoa! Uh-oh. In your face, penguin. Uh, yeah, yeah. My abashed apologies, sir. Smedley, what have I told you about playing with the toys? They're for the good boys and girls. Now please, get back to work. If that little penguin thinks he's got the best of this elf, he's barking up the wrong chimney. So, he wants to get in this bag, does he? Well, the only sure way to stop a penguin is chemistry. If and I whip me up here some super sticky glue, I'll trap him like a fly in molasses. <laughs> Tree sap. Icky goo. Puss and stuff. Chewing gum. Natural glycerin. Ooh. Smedley, I want to thank you for all your hard work this Christmas. But you look so tired. Take the rest of the night off. Ho, 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 ho. But, but I... Ho, 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 ho. Wait, Santa, wait! Make sure you give that chili nothing but call for Christmas. Whoa! You hear me? Nothing but cold, hard call. Ho, ho, ho! Merry Christmas! See Santa. Oh, Excuse me. Come on, please. Hey, kid. Hurry home. 
Your mom's baking cookies. Hey, Santa. Look, uh, we're both busy guys, so uh, here's what I want. No fair. We've been waiting here since Thanksgiving. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. no fair. Woody Woodpecker? The one who lives in a tree house and goes, ha 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 ha. Yeah, so? Mr. Woodpecker, may I call you Woody? Our records show you've been more than a little self-centered this year. Therefore, we're thinking something along the lines of, well, cool this Christmas. Furthermore, because of bad behavior, we'll be repossessing your gifts for the past five years. Have a Merry Christmas! Wow! <laughs> Can't be. No Christmas gifts. What am I gonna do? Hmm. I got it. If I videotape myself doing kind deeds, I'm sure to get right back on Santa's good list. Sometimes you gotta make good deeds happen. <laughs> What do you know? Looks like my good friend Wally's fence is broken. I took this board off my own house. <laughs> Ooh, now the cold wind whips through and chills me to the bone. But nothing is too much trouble for my pal Wally, especially at Christmas. <laughs> is not having any boundaries between neighbors. Santa, I make it my duty to clear Ms. Meanie's walkway whenever it snows. <laughs> no way I'm hand shoveling that snow. Are you kidding me? It'll take all day. Huh? Hey, got a delivery for Miss Meanie. Just a sec. Oh, a delivery, you say? Why, it's a good neighborly thing to care for your friends' packages when they aren't home. <laughs> Thanks, neighbor. Don't mention it. <laughs> Recycling her tree after Christmas. <laughs> you know, Santa, Wally just loves Christmas lights, so I thought I'd surprise him with these. Hmm. Ooh. earlier. Woof. This idea, it's not working for you. But, but... Woody, my friend, all you've done is try and look good so you can get more presents. And trust me, this doesn't make you look good. No, Charlie, wait. Take it up with the big guy. He'll be here in five minutes. Oh, five minutes? Oh, oh, 
didn't belong, Santa. Ooh, but your heart was in the right place. That was the most selfless act of bravery I've ever seen. Ooh, you know, looks like I may have been wrong about you all year long. <laughs> have a Merry Christmas, Woody. We're traveling alone. Uh, this is my, uh, uh, mwah, uh, my uncle. Oh, yeah, hey, uh, I'm from a uh, uh, very foreign country. Uh, very friendly woodpeckers there and very clean. <laughs> oh, how utterly charmed. Charmed. I've been all over the world and I've never had my hand licked before. May I? May I? <laughs> Everyone simply must meet your uncle. <laughs> Toodles for now, Mr. Woodpecker. Now look what you... <laughs> May I? Yeah, sure. I'll never win a prize. Uh -huh. Wait! 
Now, we're going to dinner. You behave. Huh? Everything's a game with you, isn't it? Everything's a game. Everything's a game. Oh, yes! I couldn't agree more. And doesn't it get so tiresome playing by the rules all the time? Sweet! Ooh, you are a breath of fresh air, Woodpecker. Oh, let's eat our dessert first and have dinner after. You social saboteur, you! <laughs> you social saboteur, you! <laughs> Are you two nuts? <laughs> oh, this is fun! Oh, this is fun! Hey, wake up! You're gonna get us kicked off this train! You! I knew you were trouble! <laughs> Gray. No, no, no! Get Kenna with me! He wants to stay! He's the life of the party! <laughs> and stay off this train! May I see your ticket, Woodpecker? Ah, uh, uh, uh. he's with me, Steward. Put his ticket, put his dinner, put this whole darn dining car on my tab. Then clean this place up at once! So we can do it all over again. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> My wild woodpecker, gone. Oh, I'd like to take this club and. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> Your cave woodpecker club will make a fine addition to our museum, Mr. Woodpecker. Is that all it's worth? Well, we do find a lot of these clubs in our digs. However, if you should ever come across one of these, you'd be absolutely set for life. <laughs>